just like here yeah, i know i'm taking a short left but i'm just going to take it anyway because consistency because followers because subscribe hey guys welcome to my channel my name is rita aka pearl light welcome to my channel Ooh, i must observe protocol and address my light gang light fam squad within depths of depths of depths hi guys welcome back to my channel i missed you guys i've got like a little 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 little, little, little while um but i'm back and i'm so excited to be back can you tell no okay and welcome if this is your first time on my channel if you want to be part of the light squad go ahead and click that red button down below and click the bell next to it so you get notified every single time I post a new video so you stay in the loop. Don't be that out of the loop friend. Stay in the loop and subscribe. Um, Let's get into why I've been gone for like two seconds because in YouTube world it's like two seconds. How long I've been gone for? Okay, two minutes. Um, Yeah, so as you guys know, <laughs> our car got jacked when we were in SA. I don't know why I'm laughing. The joy of the Lord is my strength. Amen. Um, so our car got stolen when we were in South Africa a couple of weeks ago. And um, my camera bag was in the car. Fortunately, I had my camera with me. But my camera bag was in the car. So my camera charger, what do you call it? My battery charger. I'll just say that. My battery charger was in my camera bag. So that got stolen as well. It's like every time I remember something, I'm like, hmm, where are my Birkenstocks? oh stolen and if i funny thing i i truly discovered how much my husband didn't like my Birkenstocks. <laughs> like how much he didn't like them after they were stolen and i was just like oh okay i see all right I digress, guys so the reason why i'm telling you that is to go back to my camera charger i i lost it with the car um so that was the main reason the initial reason why i wasn't filming um since the car had been stolen i tried filming on my phone the quality was just i wasn't gonna do that like it was just bad compared to my camera quality and i wasn't prepared to put out content that i wasn't happy with in terms of quality and the contents of the content if you get what i mean while i was still kind of trying to be consistent with my channel i had some content on my hard drive that i had filmed like beforehand so i i uploaded some of that but then i reached a point where i was like the content that i have i do not want to upload you know you know you can film a whole video then be like hmm, i don't know if i want to upload that it was fun filming it but yeah so that was the second thing um, that kind of hindered me from uploading um, the past two weeks. So then I just got to a point where I was like, okay, I'm not gonna upload because one, I'm not happy with my phone camera quality. Two, I don't have content on hand that I can upload that I'm happy with that really portrays what my channel is about. You know, like staying true to what the channel was mainly about. And then like, as the weeks went by, I just started getting this feeling in my heart like god like what do you want this channel to do like what do you want this channel to be about you know what i mean like that was just heavy on my heart and i was just like let me take a quick break you know let me just take a minute or two to just kind of like seek god and ask god like okay what do you want to use this channel for you know what i mean and i did take that time and god spoke through different people he spoke to me too like just having peace in my heart from the words that I was receiving from other people um, and just the conviction in my heart you know when God when you pray about something and you just get that I don't know how to explain it but it's like like inside you know that okay God has answered me you know what I mean <laughs> I hope that makes sense guys because sometimes your girl's analogies are just I can't use my words so I use my body you know so yeah okay 
I went through um, that whole thing where I was just like, okay, God, I want this channel to have purpose. I want it to have a niche because I also watched like a lot of um, influencers and YouTubers who basically teach on branding and marketing and building your brand. They were like, you need to have a niche. Basically, when people come to your channel, they know that they're coming for this specific thing. Not for that and that and your aunties that and your uncles that. You know what I mean? So that was something as well where I was just like, okay, hey God, show me what my niche is. Like, show me what my voice is. You know what I mean? For my channel. And I feel like he did that as well. So um, I feel like even like this is just advice to people who want to start a YouTube channel. You need to also listen to the Holy Spirit. There have been times where I uploaded something or I was editing something and I could just feel it in my spirit for an hour then. Let it go, like, don't upload this. Um, but like, I would just kind of like brush it off, you know what I mean? And kind of just override it and just push through. And sometimes like my rationing would be like, nah, Satan trying to stop me from being consistent. Not today, devil, you know? Um, but that's something that I'll say really listen to the Holy Spirit listen to that inner voice Some of you call it a gut and instinct is the Holy Spirit That's just that's something that told me that it's the Holy Spirit if you're a born-again spirit-filled Christian, you know um, So yeah, I just wanted to point that out as well because there was a video that I uploaded guys where I was just like, here, yeah, I know I'm taking a short left, but I'm just going to take it anyway because consistency, because followers, because subscribe. So, you know, the, the K, I'm keeping it 100 with you guys because you guys are my people. So with the K Yams tutorial, like that was the reason why I filmed that in the first place. I was like, oh, it would be fun to film me trying this out for the first time. You know, and I'd watched many videos of that kind and I was like, ah, this is cool. So I did that out of a, oh, let me just film it. It could be content that I could use or not use. You know what I mean? And I won't lie, guys. There was also in the back of my mind, I was like, K Yams might put me on my shit on her Instagram equals followers, subscription, likes, you know, so, <laughs> oh Jesus, oh Jesus, yeah, so, even with that video, like guys, editing that video took me forever, like there were so many obstacles, and part of me was like, I probably shouldn't go this route, like why am I even trying to do the beauty thing, that is not me, that is not me, like, on my social media like maybe on my instagram i would post something like that but for my youtube channel like i was just causing confusion you know so i did take a short left with that one i'm not even gonna lie guys <laughs> and i was having coffee with a friend of mine yesterday and we were talking about youtube because she also youtubes and she was like friend yeah i know that video i was just like what what's going on you know and i said to her i was like yeah i took a short left my friend like i don't know what was going on there um but Yes, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I am not a beauty vlogger. I don't think I will ever be a beauty vlogger. That's not my thing. That's not my voice. Um, that's not what I have to bring. You know what I mean? That's not the influence that I want to have. Or, or I don't want to influence through that avenue. It's just not me, sis. It's not me. So, yeah. So, I just wanted to share this to let you guys know what has been going through my mind, why I haven't been posting, why I wasn't consistent, and thank you to my cousin for keeping me accountable with that. Um, and that's why I wanted to make this video because I realized that the subscribers that I have are invested, you know what I mean? You guys are still here, even after like two weeks of not posting. And in YouTube land, two weeks of not posting, you can lose a lot of followers and subscribers, you know? So I just really wanna thank you guys so much for supporting me, for watching my content, for liking, for commenting. I love it when you guys comment and engage in what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, just enjoying the content. So going forward, I'm gonna be more consistent as I was before. I'm going to be more niche, -y. niche, -y. Um, and have less confusion on my channel about what my channel is about. And just to, in a nutshell, my channel is a Christian lifestyle channel. So most of my content is gonna be about the Bible, Jesus, and just being a Christian friend, wife, mother, living my life, you know what I mean? Trying to continue to stay on the narrow path that I hope I'm on. 
<laughs> that I'm on. Um, stay on the narrow path and just follow Christ, guys. Like, just live the life that Jesus died for me to have. Because at the end of the day, when it's all said and done, when the trumpets are blown and the things are going down, I really want to be in that number, guys. You know there's that song when the saints go marching in. I want to be in that number. I want to be in that number. I want to be there with Jesus white robe things so <laughs> yes that is me that is pearl light you know and i just want to thank you guys for coming along on this journey with me i hope that you learn i hope that you're encouraged through my channel i hope that you are edified through my channel that you're built that you're convicted that you're corrected through my channel as god does what he wants to do through it yes hope you enjoyed this video guys i will see you again in my next video i'm so excited to continue this youtube video this youtube journey i love doing this i love creating content i love speaking i love talking about the bible and how god does the things in my life yes so thank you so much i'll see you guys in my next video don't forget to join my family subscribe click the bell so you get notified every time i post a new video Thank you so much guys and thank you for 300 subscribers! I think I posted something on Instagram and Facebook but I just wanted to thank you guys here on the platform for just coming with me on this journey, for just taking time. Like, Time is such a precious commodity and the fact that you take time out of your day to come and watch me speak for however long I'm talking means so much to me and I just thank you guys so much for that. Um, yeah, thanks guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye guys.